And here we're going to talk a little bit more about the arithmetic sequence. A sequence, again, is just a listing of numbers. Put some commas in them. We're not adding these numbers, just a set of numbers. A very special set of numbers because if we, do, if we subtract any one of them from the next number, we get a what we call a common difference. For example, 25 minus 19 is 6, 19 minus 13 is 6, and so forth. So the difference between any two of the numbers always gives you the same common difference. So as an example, d is equal to, let's say, 31 minus the previous one, which is 25, which is 6. So 6 is known as the common difference. The other thing that they may ask you to do is find the nth number in a sequence. For example, what is the 25th number in this sequence? And so, or what is the 172nd number or any number? Uh, wow, that would be difficult to do if you had to write them all out, but there's an easy way to do that using this equation right here. So let's say we want to find the 25th number in this sequence. So a sub 25 is equal to the first one, a sub 1, plus 25 minus 1 times the common difference, which we just found out to be 6. And a sub 1 is the first one in the sequence, so therefore a 25 is equal to 1 plus 25 minus 1, which is 24, times 6. Now, 6 times 20 is 120, 6 times 4 is 24, that's 144 plus 1, which is 145. So you can very easily find any number in any sequence, or arithmetic sequence, simply by using this equation. And just to see how that works, let's say we find the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. How about if we find the 7 one? That should equal 37. Let's try it. So um, a sub 7 is equal to a sub 1 times 7 minus 1 times the common difference. So a sub 7 is equal to the first one, which is 1. Oh, I forgot the plus there. So this is 1 plus 6 times 6. 6 times 6 is 36 plus 1. a sub 7 equals 37. And sure enough, we found the right one. So again, whenever you have an arithmetic sequence, just a listing of numbers where the common difference is just the difference between any two adjacent numbers, you can find the common difference by taking any number, subtracting the previous one, and if you want to find the nth number in a sequence, simply take the first one, add it to the nth one minus one, times the common difference. And some good examples on how to do that.